Creating products on Printify doesn't take much time, and once you publish products to your shop, our print providers handle fulfillment and shipping, so you save time and money. Now I'll go a bit more into detail. First, browse our product catalog where you'll find t-shirts, hoodies, phone cases, mugs, and more awesome products such as swimsuits, shoes, jewelry, etc. Choose a product and select the most suitable print provider for your needs based on location, color variance, or other criteria. Under each print provider, you'll find shipping and more details, including location, shipping rates, product sizes and colors, as well as average production time. Remember that production time is an average and can vary due to seasonal changes in demand or other order-specific circumstances. Once you've chosen a product and the print provider, add your design in our mock-up generator. Make sure it meets the minimum resolution requirement. The correct size is always listed on the Add Your Design button. Depending on the product, you can add your design to the front, back, sleeves and neck labels, or even print it over the entire surface for all over print products. Use the zoom tool to change the size or reposition your artwork. Next, click on Backside. This is my back print image. And now I'll add the sleeve print to both the left and the right sleeves. And here's my inner neck label including all the product information. You can use the back label for added brand awareness and you can add multiple layers to get just the right effect. However, back labels can only be printed without the inner label and the back print. Next, you can preview the product mock-up in preview mode, but in order to continue editing or save the product, you'll have to return to edit mode. Okay, now choose product variants such as size and colors. Make sure you have fewer than 100 product variants. That limit is set by Shopify, WooCommerce, and Etsy. You can also add different artwork to different product variants. For example, dark artwork to lighter shirts and vice versa. You do this by opening your variants, clicking open the padlock symbol on the color you want to change, selecting that color, deleting the default artwork for this color, and adding artwork to this particular variant. Next, save and continue. Here you can see your color variants as mockups and choose the color of your choice for your title image. And now edit product information and then change the retail price for each size variant. This means you choose how much of a markup you want to add to the price. At this point you can publish this product straight to your shop or wait to publish it until after you order samples to make sure it's perfect. I highly recommend ordering samples to see and feel what your customers will. Our app is free and you only pay for fulfillment and shipping after you sell. Have fun creating products and making great sales. For more tutorials, tips and tricks, be sure to hit that big fat subscribe button. Also while you're at it, click on that bell icon so you're always notified when we release new content.